I do. I want to start. Hmm? Oh, I was talking to my computer. Oh. Yeah, it's a bad habit I have. Okay, we should be live on um, Vim TV. And we are going to be doing... Yep, there you are. We are going Hi. to be doing... <laughs> well, I can see you over here. Okay. We're going to be doing a quick pants are optional with my mother, who is over here. Her name is Mary. And you want to say hi? Hi. I'm Snook's mom. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> I'm visiting from Florida. There you go. Yes, she is. Okay. I'm just going to start asking the questions. Because okay. Because we're kind of under a little constraint here. Yep. Got a uh, date. Yep. You got a date. Um, what is the weirdest thing you've ever seen in somebody's house? Uh, this little wood chopper you have here. <laughs> so my house. That's weird yeah. thing, really, is yeah. what you're saying. Yeah. Okay. This little wood chopper. Well, it's a present for your grandson that never I know. There. That's, that's good, but I mean, yeah, well, it's weird. Well, okay. All right. Well, there we go. You asked me. I did. I did. I did ask you. All righty. Um, next question. Oh. Okay. What set of items could you buy that would make the cashier most uncomfortable? Make who uncomfortable? The cashier. Cashier? Yeah. Like, you know, you're in a store and you're buying something. What would make the cashier uncomfortable? Yeah. Hmm. I suppose if I bought something kind of naughty, they might be uncomfortable to see a little old lady do that. That could be. That could be. Or they'd just, you know, chuckle and be happy <laughs> about that. it. <laughs> Oh, I wonder about me, too, sometimes. <laughs> well, there you go. There you go. <laughs> um, let's see. Where do you not mind waiting? Uh, where do I not mind waiting? Um, I'm thinking of your own. I don't know. Where do I not mind waiting? I guess in the dentist. I don't mind waiting there. If they could keep me there all day. I don't want to. Yeah, the dentist is not your favorite place. No. Oh, they give me shivers. No. So I like waiting there. I'd like him to forget me. <laughs> yeah. But then he'd still have to go back. You just got to go and get it over. You didn't ask me that. Oh, well, that's true. Um, what is the stupidest thing you've done because someone dared you to do it? Oh, boy. You know, I'm pretty old. There's a lot of things I've done. <laughs> well, pick one. Hmm. Just one. I suppose drink these fireball shots. That was kind of dumb. But you had fun. Why is that? Yeah, fun? I did. But you said it's if you can have fun and it still can be stupid. Oh, well, true. But you did have a lot of fun. You were talking yes, about, you I did. still talk about that day. Yep. Then you had the fireball shots. Yeah. I, I didn't know what a fireball was and they're good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I came home and told my son in law I had a fireball and he's woo. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Because you did. You really liked those. Yeah. yeah. But I'm tolerant of alcohol. Just just a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> would, you, would you rather look like a potato or feel like a potato? Look like a potato or feel like a potato? Yeah, you'd still be human, but would you rather look I like one? I don't know what a potato feels like. I certainly don't want to look like one, so I guess... Well, I mean, I'm potatoes. looking... Weird enough without looking like a potato. So you just really don't want to deal with the whole potato scenario? No. 
Yeah. I guess I'd feel like a potato, but then they might want to peel me. I don't know. <laughs> Mix me with ham and cheese, you know. That'd be good. Well, assuming it would be like a heart, like a potato. Oh. Or like have a bunch of eyes all over. No. No, my that eyes aren't that good. I don't want any more. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. Uh, all right. So, if you were in the circus, would you rather be the person with their head in the lion's mouth or get shot out of the cannon? Oh, definitely shot out of the cannon. Yeah. That would be cool. Yeah, you would like that. Yeah. You would, you would really like that. I, wanna, I would like to skydive sometimes, so I think I'd like to be shot out of a cannon. Into a net, of course. Well... There, yeah, and that would be a, you know, yeah. kind of a good thing because you would, you know, yeah. leave. <laughs> yeah, or otherwise. otherwise, you're not, it's a, it's a one and done. Yeah, it's flat. Yeah. No. Yeah. No, I mean, no I'd, I'd like to be shot out of a cannon. Would you? Sure. You going to join the circus when you get older and grow up? Um, they don't even have circuses anymore. They, don't they have the Ringling Brothers anymore? No, I think they closed because they didn't want them to have animals, and they didn't want this, and they didn't uh, want that. Uh, uh. So, uh, you know, I'd like to. Wow, I didn't know that. Yeah. They, they don't even have them at all anymore? I, I think it's really watered down. I don't really think they have circuses. I think Ringling Brothers quit. Or, Did they? Because I'm, of that? Yeah, I think so. Hmm. I didn't know that. I'll have to look that up when we're done. Okay. Oh, it's only 4.30. we got plenty of time. Okay. Before my hot date. Before your hot date, <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. That would be your third hot date. Oh, something like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Something like that. Um, this isn't being seen in Florida, right? <laughs> <laughs> well, unless Herman's over at your house with Alex right now, I don't know. I don't know if, if Alex is watching right now or not. <laughs> we'll just let him know not to let Herman watch this. <laughs> no, don't even mention that. <laughs> I mean, I'm a... What? what? I've been what having a good time up here. Yes, I know you have. <laughs> <laughs> uh. What's an ideal Christmas or for you? What's an ideal Christmas for me? Mm -hmm. Oh, I think those are over. The ideal Christmas was for me was when my when I was my kids were little. And the church bells would start to ring at 7 o'clock. Yeah. And at 7 o'clock, they could come downstairs, and they'd rush downstairs. Yeah. And we had a Christmas tree and just everything. That was my best Christmas. Yeah. They were, they were, yeah. Those were. But my kids couldn't get up until the bells started ringing. So they hardly got the first bing off us. Oh, a, yeah. And no, you, they we were, were down. Up. We were up and had <laughs> already looked, and yeah, no. <laughs> and then we were waiting. But yeah, that was that was fun. Now Christmas is, it's okay. But I mean, it, it's not it's the nothing. same. When Alex yeah. moved away, or you know, he got older. It's, yeah, it's, it's not the same as when you have little kids. No. It might be fun this year because I'll have Alex and ladies with me. I yeah. think I'm I not think sure. I, but, yeah, right. Yeah. But uh, very true. Yeah. But it, I enjoy Christmas. But uh, and I had my all my little people. Yeah, your village. Yeah, my village and all my little people. Yeah. Yeah, which is very true. So maybe I'll decorate and do stuff for Christmas. I don't know yet. No, it's a ways away. Mm-hmm. It's a ways away. Well, that's good. All right. Um, describe your life using one word. Happy. There you go. There you go. I have had a good life. Hi. Um. It's 
some downtown swings, but most of the time, it's been happy. Yeah. Or I'm at peace or whatever, so. Yeah. Oh, I know it just. Well, you had a lot of fun. You used to go out to yeah. all those balls and everything. I went to balls. I sang all over the world. I yeah. had good friends all over. Yeah. yeah. So I, I've had a good life. I think so. And I hope to have another couple of years of it. <laughs> well, at least 10. Yeah. At least 10 or so. <laughs> yeah, about 10, 15 would be yeah, good. Yeah, yeah. I'm going for okay. the 15, but yeah. yeah. 15 would be good. Yeah, that'd be good. Yeah. Um, what do you think about clowns? About what? Clowns. Clowns. I don't like clowns. Uh, not a lot of people do. No. Um, They're kind of... After I read that book by, I think, Stephen that King or something. A lot of clowns. Yeah. It. I, I never liked clowns after that. And I don't like a lot of slapstick. So that's not my kind of humor. Yeah, true. I don't like falling down and all this kind of. So I'm more of the dry Jack Benny type of humor. I like his humor and. Uh, so you didn't like. Um... Things like that, but. Um, I think the older uh, comedians were a lot funnier than the newer comedians. I happen to agree with that. Yeah, but you at least I think. Well, hmm? well, because they didn't use swear words to, to, they actually had. Yes, but now everyone has to be so politically correct that I mean, back in when I was young. I mean, you could laugh at yourself. You could laugh at each other. You could enjoy being outrageous. Now, my goodness, yeah. if you said anything, they say, oh, you can't say that. You might hurt someone's feelings. Well, you know, so what? Yeah. If it's funny, it's funny. Yeah. And your dad used to tell a lot of jokes that would not probably be considered politically correct now. No. No. No, they wouldn't. And he was a very funny man. Yeah. Yeah, he was. But he used to get made fun of because he was Polish. Yes. We, and we but, got made fun of because we were Polish. But it didn't ruin your egos or your no. bikies or anything. I mean. Well, no, but I had an easy out. Yeah. Well, I mean, I was made fun of because I was um, not real tall. No, you're very short. It's not real but, tall is an understatement. <laughs> it's, it's, it's not, well, what do they call that? Um, I can't remember, but anyway. You, you are height challenged or something. <laughs> something. I'm, yeah. I'm ch challenged. But, um, <laughs> but, you know, it never. Well, but you learned to, to um, fight. I could adjust. You it. learned to fight because you were short. Yes. And I would tell people, you can take advantage of me, but look out, because I'll get even. Yes. Yeah. Very so, good. am yeah. I talking too much? No. <laughs> no, you're not. No. Okay. This is, um, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I just. Uh, let's see. Oh. At what age, now think about this question, at what age did you become an adult? So in your head, at what age did you become um, an adult? 19. At 19? Okay. Yep. All right. That's when I made all my major decisions. So you, all your adulty decisions was at 19? Yep. yep. Yeah. And now people at 19 are... Yeah. I considered babies, but uh, yeah. yeah, yeah. On my nineteenth birthday, I uh, well, yeah, yeah. So I that I think nineteen. Okay. Bacon or sausage? If you had to only have one, what would bacon. it be? Really? Bacon. Really? I love bacon. I know, but breakfast sausage. I love sausage too. <laughs> well, I was just gonna say so, but bacon really. Well, usually on weekends, I have bacon one day and sausage the next. I know, but if you could only have one for the rest of your life, what would it be? Bacon. Oh, interesting. 
Nice crisp bacon. Why wouldn't it get that well? Bacon, lettuce, and tomato, bacon and oh, eggs, bacon and uh, hamburger. Ba I mean, bacon goes with, they even have chocolate covered bacon. I haven't tried that because that, I like chocolate and I like I bacon. Don't, but I don't, yeah. I, I don't think they really go together. I think. I'm do. not sure I would like the chocolate covered bacon, but I saw it. Uh, but I didn't spend money for it. No. Is a hot dog, would you consider a hot dog a sandwich? No. I, no. My daughter <laughs> likes that. I, no. No. Tell the story. You'd eat a cold hot dog while your other one was cooking in the microwave. <laughs> well, no, that was back when you had to wait for it to boil in the pan. Yeah. Oh, boil. I knew that when it was cooking. I couldn't remember. Yeah. But you'd eat a cold one while you were cooking the other but one. It and... took like forever to boil in the pan. So, no. I uh, <laughs> never really cared that much for hot dogs. <laughs> But you love those little sausages. You loved all that kind of stuff. Yeah, but, I did. I yeah. did. I do. I do. You do. Sausages are great. Well, some of them are really good, but there are some that they have the funny spice in it. I don't like. That's why bacon. You can't really screw up bacon. Well, true. But like the best dinner is the you buy that that round bologna. Oh yeah, that's with macaroni good. and cheese, and and, yes. uh, and peas, frozen peas, not yeah, you know, our real peas, but mm -hmm. that's, yeah, that's like good. the best meal ever. Yeah, that's pretty good. I mean, that's I a, like macaroni and cheese. That's a top ranking meal in my yeah. book. And, and it's I like got all the colors in it. Yep. Because you were always, you had to match, you couldn't have, like, a bland plate of food. No, well, I had to have three colors that have three right. types of food. Yeah, I was, well, I taught Girl Scouts for uh, home, their home badge. Yeah. Uh, they got their home, whatever that badge is, home something. Yeah, I don't anyway. know. <laughs> I don't know. So I would teach them how to set the table. Kids don't even know how to set tables anymore. No. They just go to McDonald's. And my computer just stopped. It'll start again. In, in, in a, just a minute. What do you mean it just stopped? Oh, let me go look. She's in the other room. Hold on. I'll be right back. Um, I don't have a be right back, so I'll just be right back. Uh-oh. That's all right. It's probably... Oh, it, like, literally just stopped. Now I couldn't hear you here. I couldn't hear you. No, it's... Oh. No, oh, that's because the light... What? Uh... Do we have to stop? Well... I don't know if this will turn back on or not. I don't think so. It's no, I mean, it was... I forgot to turn the hall light on for the... There I am again. Oh, there you go. But I, uh, I don't know. I don't hear anything. Well, put there your... That's because I'm not talking. Well, no, but it should be working now. Can you hear me? Through the, through the, you can't, through the headset? Oh. Well, I can hear you because you're in the other room. <laughs> but I can't hear you from the computer. <laughs> All right. All right. Well, that sucked. Why can't you hear me? Well, I suppose maybe it's so... Um, well, they see me over here now. Oh, I forgot my glasses. Do you have enough? Yeah, we will. All right.
Well, this tap. Alright. No, it's. Bah, it wouldn't be your fault. <laughs> Gotta throw that in there. I know it's not my fault. <laughs> All right, so that was my mother. For those who wanted to know, that was her. Have a great day. Bye. <laughs>